So I've got a tricky little shot here. And I think we get this a lot on the courses, especially when we haven't hit the worst of approaches into the greens. It's kind of rolled down the slope. We're now in a situation that I think people get the strategy wrong and that's why they struggle. Today's video, I'm explaining how to improve that. Hi guys, thanks for checking the video out. Steve Buzzer here. I'm kind of short-sighted, kind of not though, that you know this isn't the worst scenario. But what I see too many amateur golfers do is they try and play too safe a flight that's required for the shot. What that makes you do is maybe get the ball too far back in your stance, you push forwards, causes you tons of issues. This shot needs a medium to high flight. If you try to see a low one going in there, a safe one, you now can't get the ball close, plus that technique is running the risk of doing this. And send this to a mate that does this. Don't, obviously you've never done it, but too safe in the backswing. Good contact, but it's gone in too low. Look at that one, I even hit the pin. I bet your mate doesn't do that. But can you see it hit the pin and it's still gone shooting forwards. So that was a good technique, but I'm seeing too safe a flight. So what's going to happen if I keep doing that? And then we start getting that because then your body starts reacting. Your body's actually trying to help, but I can't imagine that's what you scream. Thank you body for trying to help. You know, it totally destroys not only your score, but your confidence. So we've got to be prepared to see the ball going in high. That means we're going to have a little bit of wrist movement. It's fine to have a little bit of wrist movement, but first things first, just seeing the ball go in that little bit higher. Alternatively, in this situation, or I'm seeing it go really low. I'm not picking that low wedge trajectory. I'm going low with a hybrid or like a seven iron, or I'm gonna do this shot. See, prepared to use the wrist. Not having to open up too much. And I pop it up. That shot gives me better interaction with the ground, so I'm actually not gonna hit as many miss hits. But the height holds the green, my confidence goes up, short game and scores gets better. So get some comments down below. Are you the person that's been trying to drive the ball in too low because it feels safe? Because that could be the thing that's really destroying your short game. Thanks for watching, hope to catch you soon.